What it is guys, my name is Swifters and today I'm going to be bringing you an awesome unlimited money glitch in GTA 5 Online after the 1.12 patch update. Now guys, I did upload an unlimited money glitch the other day, however this method is so much better because I believe that it does bypass the 45 minute wait period and you guys are able to use supercars. Now guys, all I ask is that before this video does get underway, you'd slap that like button and subscribe to my channel as I am trying to reach 25,000 subscribers and by subscribing and showing your support, it would really mean a lot. Also guys, huge shout out to my good friend Codflaws, this is his game play that he's allowing me to use so if you'd like to check out his channel his link will be in the description so let's get started so guys, the first thing that you're going to want to do is make your way over to your garage and get inside of a vehicle that you don't mind getting rid of as it will be gone by the end of this glitch. We're going to be using the Karen Rebel because I believe that it does work best with the Karen Rebel. So we're going to get inside of that and take it over to Los Santos Customs. So guys, once you get to Los Santos Customs, what you're going to want to do is park the vehicle exactly like you see me doing so. As long as the garage door to Los Santos Customs does open, you should be fine. So after you park the vehicle exactly like you see me doing so, what you're going to want to do is pull up your phone and go to your contacts list and you're either going to want to call Pegasus, Merriweather, or your mechanic as long as you guys receive this screen to request a vehicle you should be fine so as you receive the screen simultaneously drive inside of the garage and if you've done everything correctly you should be able to drive inside of the garage without actually having to modify the vehicle now guys you do need two people in order to do this glitch so what you're gonna want to do is have your friend sitting inside of the car with you as you take it into Los Santos customs and as you get outside of the car it should automatically put your friend from the passenger seat into the driver's seat after you've done those steps correctly in Los Santos customs get inside of a vehicle and take it back over to your garage so once inside of your garage, make your way over to the vehicle that you're going to be selling. In this case, we're going to be using the Voltic, but I believe that you guys can use whatever vehicle that you would like. So simply get inside of the vehicle and take it over to Los Santos Customs. From here, what we're going to be doing is the exact same thing that we did with the Karen Rebel. So simply pick up your phone and call either your mechanic, Pegasus, or Merriweather. And as you guys receive this screen, simultaneously drive inside of Los Santos Customs. And then what you're going to want to do from there is get outside of the vehicle that you just took into Los Santos Customs. Make your way over to the other vehicle and hold Y in order to kick your friend out of that car. So as you guys can see on the bottom left hand corner of the screen, which is the minimap, there's actually a personal vehicle outside on the street that's actually the Voltic with a tracker inside of it. That's the vehicle that we're going to be selling because it was actually duplicated. So what you're going to want to do is get outside of that Karen Rebel or whatever vehicle is inside of the garage and make your way over to the other vehicle that you're going to be selling. In this case, it's the Voltic. So what you're going to want to do from there is have your friend get inside of your personal vehicle and drive it far enough away that allows you guys to request a vehicle. As you guys know, if your vehicle is close by, you're not actually allowed to request a vehicle from your mechanic. So simply have your friend get inside of that vehicle and drive it far enough away that you guys can request the vehicle that's sitting right next to you. In this case, it's going to be the Karen Rebel. But like I said, I believe that you guys can use whatever vehicle that you would like. So as you guys can see, as my friend drives away, I'm able to request the vehicle. And as I request the Karen Rebel, which is sitting next to me, it does disappear. Now as you guys do request the vehicle, what you're going to want to do is hit right on the d-pad so it puts you inside of this screen that allows you guys to sell the vehicle. However, we're actually not going to sell the vehicle as of right now. What we're actually going to be focusing on is the bottom right hand corner of the screen. So as you can see, there's an orange rotating circle which means that the game is saving. So after that circle appears, then disappears, you guys are more than welcome to go ahead and sell your vehicle. So as you guys sell the vehicle, you're going to want to make your way outside of Los Santos Customs and get inside of the Karen Rebel which was actually delivered to you. If you guys remember when we had our mechanic screen open, we requested the vehicle that was sitting right next to us. In this case it was the Karen Rebel. But as you guys can see, as we take the vehicle over to our garage, it actually disappears but we actually do have our duplicated version of the Voltic so we're able to repeat all of these steps again in order to do this unlimited money glitch for a second time. Now guys, I know that this process is a little bit tedious because you do need a friend in order to do it and the process just takes a little bit of time, however you guys do get a decent amount of money and I will be doing my best in order to find a brand new solo unlimited money glitch after the 1.12 patch because I know doing these glitches with friends is a little bit difficult to do because you guys both need to coordinate stuff and uh, it's just not very ideal so I will be doing my best in order to find a brand new solo unlimited money glitch. Now guys, that's all I really do have for you in this video, I hope you did enjoy it and if you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for some of the best GTA 5 content. Content. I do post the latest tips, tricks, glitches, news, and easter eggs found in GTA 5. Until next time guys, this has been Swifters, I'm out. Peace.